Thanks, Anna. Well, speaking of jobs and more opportunities, as Small Business Week comes to an end, one nonprofit leader wants to encourage a specific group of entrepreneurs to push the community forward. That's right. Fox 44's Sydney Simone has more on how he plans to inspire and educate the capital region. Over the last decade, businesses have encountered much adversity, rebuilding after natural disasters, a global pandemic, and now the risk of another recession. Life, life is going to life. Life is going to do what it does. Aaron Franklin, chairman and founder of the Black Chamber of Commerce, says the Baton Rouge area lost about 55 to 60 percent of black owned businesses. The reason why is because people stop shopping. The majority of the black businesses are either uh, uh, insurance or financially related, right? Um, most of them are just first time entrepreneurs, right? So you got a couple of them that have like retail stores, et cetera, et cetera. Like how can you pay your bills without having income? Franklin says earning trust and strengthening the relationship between business owners and the community is key. We advocate, we're trying to get people contracts. Like we're in the middle of um, driving connections, um, driving contracts, uh, partnering up with the state, local, uh, so we can get people money. The goals are to inspire, educate, and cultivate economic success in the capital region. So that is a 501c3, which, you know, we can actually receive donations and stuff like that, so we can actually push the chamber forward, right? Because we have to, as a community, invest in organizations like that in order to, like, really make a dent. Franklin says small businesses are the backbone of any community. We see it constantly in every other community. They work together. They move together, like they spend together, they invest together, like, but that's, that's a level of trust that we as a community have to reach. Despite inflation, Franklin is confident that Baton Rouge can bounce back from hardship if we take advantage of the local resources. Now, I will say there's a reassurgence of black businesses that are coming up now. Um, people are opening daily. As a business owner, realtor, and founder of the Black Chamber, Franklin is committed to making his hometown better. He plans to open a bar and winery downtown in the near future. People don't stop drinking in regards to any type of thing, right? People are going to drink. So create the product that you, that you love the most. Like, just create it. Sydney Simone, Fox 44 News.